Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Tomb Raider Anniversary with me, Raven. Um, we are now on level, well, area 2 I guess. The right mouse is locked onto the enemies to perform special maneuvers. Shit! This is gonna... Well, that didn't really end quite as I expected it to. I believe there's a second bear. As you can imagine, I'm gonna die a lot at the bosses. Which most of them weren't actually in the original. It seemed kind of weird that they decided that they were gonna add bosses in. As if to go, oh well, you know. Games need bosses nowadays, and it's just like, no, we, we really don't. Like, just keep the damn thing like the original. The original was good. Wow, really? <laughs> That's fucking ridiculous. You all saw that. Like, I can put her in the direction I needed her in, and then, nope, she wasn't going to do it. See, there we go. And ah, I'm glad you did it this time. <coughs> City of Vink Vilcabamba. I remember there's some wolves and a bear down the bottom. And I hear the bear. I can't remember which room it's in. Oh, it's not in a room. Maybe I should check my journal to find out like where the hell that's supposed to be. Okay, yeah, Laura's gonna probably drown here. <laughs> up, up, no, <laughs> up, oh good lord, yeah, she's definitely gonna start drowning. <coughs> ah, we're close. I love how Laura gets wet in this. Like, it's the same in the other games, like, um, in Legend, uh, I think they added that in Legend, where like she got wet um, as you played through it, like whenever you went to, into water and then slowly dried off. So you see the clothes and, and her change. Really? Really? You're not even going to let me step on that. That is ridiculous. Just use this instead. 
I mean, yeah, I know it's only a medi pack, but still, I'm gonna need them. I mean, I sucked with the original game. I was surprised when I actually beat the original game, considering like I could get to the end boss. It was kind of tough. Like, get to that sort of demon thing at the end. E key. But, like, it took me absolutely ages to be able to beat her. By the way, there is a reason why I'm, I'm dragging this outside. You need it to get, like... I don't think you need it to get out, but you need it for one of the secrets. Like, we bring it over here to this. Because now we can jump up here. Oh, that didn't really work. Come on, girl. Where about There we go wasn't the most graceful. In this one I can't get onto the top of the poles. Which kinda sucks. It'd it make it easier. What? Come on! Oh, you saw her even grab for the damn thing. Good thing that's a checkpoint. There we go. Yeah, that's what should have happened the first bloody time. Oh, sure they will turn up. <laughs> Yay, whoa. Oh, shit. What, what the? I don't remember. I need to remember what the button is. Because, like, the on-screen buttons tell you what the keyboard controls are, but not, like, the 360 controller controls, even though, like, it natively supports that over normal controllers. So, it, it's a little weird that they don't give you the on-screen options based on, like, the control method you're using. I like this area because like, you can do it any way you want. That's something I did like about the Tomb Raiders. Um, like, well, the early Tomb Raiders is like, there wasn't just a single path you could take or like, one thing you could do at a time. Like, you had a bit of freedom in what you did. I may need to turn the brightness up a little bit because you don't get a torch anywhere in this game. Oh shit! Blasted bats. complicated shit for the win.
Okay, and clearly that's not the way to go. Or maybe it is. Okay. What? <laughs> There's no way you'd have been able to grab that. That was just a little too damn far. Look at those bats when it was downstairs. through this for the first time like me and my friend were playing it and it was hilarious because I'd watch I'd actually be watching him play it rather than like I would be playing it because like he had the play like he could uh, he had a PlayStation whereas I didn't I still like had my snares and like I had a PC I did get it for the PC but it was kind of it was a different experience on the PC compared to the PlayStation And it was funny because, like, everything in the game kind of scared him. I mean, we were, like, I don't know. We were, like, 12 at the time or something like that. But, 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 I'll get used to doing that bloody stuff. But, you know, it's just... It's just really amusing, like, how scared he got of it. I don't really talk to that friend anymore, though. It's kind of a shame. Mine, it was, it was funny. Like, when we were growing up, we always thought that he was a little bit, I don't know, yeah, camp? Yeah, we all thought he was camp. We weren't sure whether he was gay or not, but we all thought he was camp, and then it, it turned out, like, he was, like, proper gay. <laughs> like, I, I met him uh, a few years um, after coming back from the States for a university, and for him to turn around and go, uh, he's like, oh, hi, man, and I'm like, oh, how are you doing? He's like, ah. Oh. Not bad. This is my my boyfriend, um, um, Reese, and I'm just like, oh, wait, wait, what? <laughs> I mean, we never saw him with a girlfriend, and like he didn't really show any interesting girls, so kind of telltale signs, I guess. But it was just, I thought it was absolutely hilarious, especially like the way like he was, uh, he introduced uh, like he introduces him because uh, like. You know when people are like, ah, oh, you know, they make this big, massive performance about the fact that they're, they're gay or something like that. And like, that's what he did. <laughs> and like, I remember half of us, like who were still talking, just turned around and go, huh, yeah, we kind of figured that. <laughs> so, yeah. But I still kind of, like, whenever I play a game that kind of makes me jump or something like that, like the Dead Space games, I mean, they're not, they're not scary as such, but they've got a lot of things in them that make you jump. And I've got so many friends who are so scared of those, but, you know, it's, I, I just imagine how much he would crap himself playing that, it'd be fucking hilarious. Anyway. That is the city uh Vilcambamba. Um so we will be back after these messages. Mm-hmm. There we go.